Hello guys, this is me, Jamie here from the Tech Community Centre. This is the start of Gamers Month and we'll start by playing a game co called PBS Kids Play and Learn Science. But I don't really think its, it's premises is, a, is as a game as what a game is defined as. And let me tell you what a game is defined as. It's defined as being fun, fun, challenging, sometimes easy in some scenarios, sometimes hard. Sometimes people are so on hardcore on that game that they won't get a game over screen. This game has none of this. This game is full on. No, not Wario Will. No, not New Super Mario Bros. No, not the Wizard Eye. No, not Kick the Buddy. PBS Kids Play and Learn Science. And we're gonna start playing it in 3, 2, 1. Explore what happens when objects go down the slide. A slide is a kind of ramp. Ramps have one end higher than the other. Tap an object to move it to the top of the slide. Does it roll or slide? Round things roll. Does it roll or slide? Objects with flat surfaces slide. Why does it roll? Round things roll. Let's aim for the target. Use the ramp to get the object on the target. Use the arrows to make the ramp steeper or flatter to help the object roll. Tap and your ramp was just steep enough to reach the target. Tap an object to move it to the top of the ramp. That went too far. How can you change the ramp to make it stop sooner? That went too far. How can you change the ramp to make it stop sooner? Your ramp was just steep enough to reach the target. A ball rolls differently on different surfaces. Some surfaces create more friction with the ball. Friction is a force that slows down things that are moving. Tap on a surface that you think will help the ball roll far enough to reach the hole. Dirt. Tap the button or tap D to get the ball moving. The dirt is too soft and squishy. Try another surface. Brick. Tap the button or tap D to get the ball moving. Let's explore shadows. Tap to add objects to the scene to observe their shadows. The object blocks the light from the sun. Where is the sun when you see a very long shadow?
Shadows look different depending on where the sun is in the sky. Tap to add objects to the scene. Move the sun and observe what happens to their shadows. Compare the shadows of different objects. What do you notice? Where is the sun when you have a long shadow? Tap the arrow for a new scene. What's making that shadow? Tap Look closely at the shadow. What happens to the shadow if you move it farther from the light? Tap the arrow to see a new shadow. on a thermometer to see what the temperature is. A thermometer is a tool that tells you how hot or cold something is. The liquid in the thermometer rises when the temperature is warm or hot. What does the thermometer look like when the temperature is cold? Tap the arrow to change the scene. Try another thermometer. The higher the number on the digital thermometer, the hotter the temperature. Look where the needle stops on a dial thermometer. Dark blue is freezing cold and red is hot. Drag the circle up and down the thermometer to change the temperature and control the weather. What happens when you tap the cloud button? You made it rain! ready for a swim. Tap the thermometer you think shows the right temperature for a swim day. D is bundled up for a cold day. Tap the thermometer that shows that it is cold. Dot is dressed for cold weather. Pick a thermometer that shows it is cold. Dell is dressed for the cold. Tap a thermometer that shows that it is cold. D is bundled up for a cold day. Tap the thermometer that shows that it is cold. cold and snowy. Tap on Dot to see what she wears to keep warm. It 
it's a warm day. Tap on Dell to see what he wears to stay cool. It's a rainy day. Tap on D to see what she wears to protect herself in the rain. Look at the weather outside the window. Help Dell pick clothes that are just right for the weather. Pick something from the closet. Pick something from the shoe shelf. Pick something from the hat rack. Look at the weather outside the window. Help Dell pick clothes that are just right for the weather. Tap on the door to open it. Help Dot choose materials to build an umbrella that will protect her from the rain. Tap on an object you think will make a good umbrella. Help Dot choose materials to build an umbrella that will protect her from the rain. Tap on an object you think will make a good umbrella. So now that we've finished that game, here comes the big question. Do I approve of the gameplay or the stuff that lies in between us? I think 10 out of 10 because of course I love Dufty and Dell and the things that they do. So my final my final marks are 10 out of 10. Stay tuned for more Game of Month videos on the way. Now let's close down.